Welcome back, pizza lovers. Today is your day. It's National Pizza Day, and while you're getting ready to order that pie or throw one in the oven, think about creating one and maybe go healthy. Amy Lacey is the author of best-selling cookbook, Cauliflower Kitchen, and she's joining us to share a couple ideas for making an at-home cauliflower pizza. Amy, good morning to you. Thanks for joining us today. Good morning. Thank you so much for having me. Absolutely. And happy National Pizza Day. Yes, it's an honor to be here, and I'm so excited to talk to you about eating pizza again because I am an autoimmune survivor. I'm a lupus uh, patient, and I was unable to eat pizza, so I created a cauliflower pizza crust. And so we have all kinds of healthy options. You can eat pizza again, and you don't have to worry about it. And I'm excited to share with you. That, that is incredible. And yeah, ha happy National Pizza Day to you as well. Many of us, of course, enjoy it. Uh, but the thing about pizza, you say, is that it doesn't have to be unhealthy. So explain. So yeah, so the pizza crust that I created has five ingredients in it. It's cauliflower. And I love cauliflower because it takes on the flavor of whatever you put it with. It's eggs, a little mozzarella cheese, and some spices. So what I've done today is I've created all different kinds of pizza for you. I've got a zucchini noodle pizza. You can use zucchini noodles, a little bit of cheese, and our cauliflower pizza crust. Throw that in the oven, and you've got a great little veggie pizza. I've also done our traditional pepperoni, margarita, some Mediterranean, and I love anything with five ingredients or less. So I wanted to surprise your viewers today by sharing a recipe that's in the cookbook for a chocolate goat cheese pizza. Now, if you're going to take this anywhere, you're going to be the hit of the party because chocolate, cauliflower, goat cheese doesn't sound good, but put it all together and it's amazing. So in the cookbook, I'm sharing the cauliflower pizza crust from Cauliflower Foods. It's the Italian crust that I have here today in the recipe book. You can do a jalapeno crust if you like spicy. We've just taken a little bit of goat cheese and put in some cream, about two tablespoons of heavy whipping cream. Whip that up. Go ahead and spread that on your cooked, cooled cauliflower pizza crust. Then add some slivered almonds, really simple and then drizzle on some chocolate. I'm using lilies because it's a little bit healthier, but you can use any kind of chocolate drizzle you want. And then some fresh mint leaves to top it off. And you take this to a Super Bowl party or any kind of party and you will be wowed. Um, it's a great, delicious, healthy, keto-friendly pizza. And like I said, we're using the cauliflower pizza crust. I do have the pizza crust recipe in the cookbook or you can purchase it online. You can um, purchase, purchase the cookbook online or the pizza crust already made online. And you can also purchase the pizza crust at Giant and as well as Nationwide and Walmart. So it's very exciting that we are able to bring that out to everybody because so many people think they can't eat pizza anymore and they can and it's healthy and you will not taste the cauliflower, I promise. Uh, yeah, that, <laughs> I can certainly tell that. Uh, one last question for you here. You know, what's your favorite recipe in the book? Okay. My favorite by far is, and I'm going to be serving this for Super Bowl Sunday, is the buffalo chicken pizza. I love chicken. I love buffalo sauce. I love spicy. I love blue cheese. So this is my favorite. I'll be serving this this weekend. Um, it's delicious. Again, you won't taste the cauliflower for all you fans that don't like cauliflower. You can't, you will not taste it. I promise it takes on any flavors you put with it. So that's my favorite. There are so many recipes in the cookbook, 125. You can go online too and find all kinds. Thank you so much for having me. Thank you for stopping by. Happy National Pizza Day. We appreciate the tips, advice, cauliflower kitchen. We'll see you again. Stay with us, everybody. We are coming back right after this.